good my YouTube people as you can see we're always where we're at working out by the beach just getting a few reps in. and I thought maybe let me just come and talk to to my people and just let them understand what's going on with my trading right now and as you can see with my trading right now for like the last month finally stuck to my plan last month two three weeks whatever you want to say finally starting to stick to the plan seeing the potential in the plan but not yet getting the results that i want not yet getting the outcome that i want but i've literally done this enough times to know what both sides is like on one side you might take profits you might do this and that but like somehow some way it feels like you're always still losing a lot more but on this side it feels like on the side of discipline it feels like every decision that i make on that day is helping me to trade the next day every time i manage risk on that day even though i'm not getting the results that i want it's helping me to be able to trade another day to have more capital for another day at the same point in time every time i let the price run to my take profit it's like all those losses that you took all those losses that you managed to risk this is exactly why you did it for this one fucking trade to work so like when it comes to sticking with the plan sticking with the consistency nobody can tell you about it you have to see it for yourself and of course before i even like got onto the charts using real money and i was demo trading which a lot of people give demo trading a bad rap but it's a really good fucking thing to do because like that i discovered my strategy my tactic how the fuck i'm going to execute on my shit because of the demo accounts if it wasn't for that that would have been a lot of loan money but it gave me time to really nail down a strategy because i started off trading one way i started off with support and resistance but for me personally that method did not suit my personality and from there on we went on to do a little bit more research a little bit more research and that's how i came up with the strategy that i have right now and even after i found that strategy out i see myself taking a lot of unnecessary losses and then i thought to myself okay how can i change that now and i put in more measures just to protect myself as well that's why right now i'm sticking to the plan even though i'm not seeing results i haven't seen results i don't know if it works but in the build up to me getting that plan that i can finally stick to is because i went through a lot of tinkering a lot of a lot of changes in my approach i went through a lot of changes in my approach that led me to this moment in time that's why now i can solidly stand by and say that i'm going to stand by and stick to my plan because i know that this whole time i've been tinkering and not sticking to the plan because i've been trying to get the best result well now that i feel like i've gotten a strategy that's going to give me the best results i feel like the only fair thing to do is to execute on it which i haven't yet perfectly gotten that discipline and that execution because i still feel the need to take profits early even though i know that that's very detrimental to my plan if i take those profits early overall i'm going to end up in losses anyways so like it's better to just hold it but you guys know how it is it's a muscle you have to train it every day get used to it and the more you see yourself sticking to the plan the more you see yourself being disciplined and consistent the more confidence you're going to get so it's just a matter of time it's just a matter of time and I personally feel like time just hasn't caught up to um reality just hasn't caught up to where I'm at in my head reality just hasn't caught up yet so you just need to give it a little bit of time let reality catch up to where you are in your head and then from there just continue to execute continue to trade don't stop for nothing man don't stop for anything if you, even if you don't have any 
capital in your account bro don't stop trading don't stop learning because once you stop learning and once you stop trading you're already starting a new habit of not being a trader and if you really see yourself as a trader then regardless of the situation regardless of the circumstances you have to try and make it onto the charts every single day and keep your streak going keep trading every single day keep gathering data and information that's going to be vital for you in years to come because it's not a one day game it's not a two day game it's not a two year game it's not a three year this is decades or decades on end this is something that you can literally do till the day that you die because it's all a mental unless maybe you're like a boxer or like you're in the nfl or some shit and like your head's been getting bashed up a lot and in towards your old age you can't really function but like apart from that apart from that small anomaly anyone else that learns the skills literally something that you can do until the day that you die until you're 100 fucking years old the charts have always been there trade has always been there and will always be there as long as people are there and they're exchanging goods and they're exchanging money and they're making transactions trading will always be there till the end and it's probably been there since the beginning from the first time one man gave another man something from the first time we went into barter trading from the first time we went into monetary trading it's always been there because people will always want to exchange value so don't stop because this is something that's going to be there forever and your contributions right now are going to be taken by the next generation and used to further develop the industry as retail traders on the internet we are still a very fucking young market what it's been maybe like a decade no more than two decades i'm sure not more than 15 years since retail trading has begun since it's been accessible to the everyday person so you can't underestimate that we're in, a, in an industry that's going to continue growing no matter what because it's still a very fucking young industry so it's going to continue growing and it's going to continue getting bigger and those who adopted early just like youtube just like all these other things those who adopted early are going to have an advantage over those who come in later not to say that those who come in later cannot come in and make significant contributions to the industry but those who start off early have a head start they have an advantage so the sooner you see this video if you're thinking about day trading i think i've made it quite clear why you should be a day trader and if you're struggling for consistency and you're thinking maybe trading is not for you i'm telling you again this is still a baby industry even if you don't end up a trader stay in the industry have that skill of the chart that's something that cannot be taken away from you you'll always have that knowledge with you forever can't be taken away